I would like to introduce you to Mr. Robinson. He is the scientific director of Matefat. Can you tell me what you do here, please? Yeah, sure. Uh -huh. Welcome, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is a center, as you can see. We are a materials library, mm -hmm. which is uh, something quite new. Mm -hmm. uh, we have several centers in the world, and this is one of them. Mm -hmm. Uh, here, uh, what we do in Matarifat is we, we analyze new trends, new technologies applied to materials. Mm -hmm. We look at it from a chemical standpoint. We look at it from the aesthetic and functional ergonomic, many mm -hmm. categories, I would say. And uh, right now here we have uh, a large collection uh, of all kinds. And so, yeah, we're, we analyze technologies and materials and set trends for innovation. Fantastic. Well, one can tell you here because during the pandemic we have developed a new finishing for fabrics that is a BOC, it's called BioBlock. And uh, this is because people uh, want to live in a sanitized uh, mm. place. Uh, and, and that's why this uh, finishing uh, allows the virus to, to disappear. I don't know if you can explain better than me, please. What about BioBlock? What is it? <laughs> well, it's a difficult explanation, really, but simply looking at this, uh, we are looking at molecular interactions. Mm -hmm. Okay, now a bioblock is, as, as I understand, has a selene, a quaternary ammonium selene. Mm -hmm. uh, this is a complex molecule. It's a molecule that has a particular shape. Mm -hmm. Okay, the shape is actually one of the key factors mm -hmm. that uh, attributes its properties. And it's virucidal or biocidal in general um, properties are given by the fact that it is a quaternary ammonium. Mm -hmm. So that's one aspect. Mm -hmm. And the other aspect is that uh, it has a long alkyl chain. Mm -hmm. And this long alkyl chain looks like a sword, literally, like a needle. Mm -hmm. And in fact, it is. Mm -hmm. It's a molecular needle. And so when we have the deposition of some uh, living cell, which can be a fungus, it could be a virus, it could be a bacteria, we have the penetration of the, of the cell wall by this uh, molecule. And we know that that has the properties of disrupting the function, and therefore you have this um, uh, biocidal effect. This collection is the first one that Ranjero has developed with this finishing, BioBlock, it is called Kimono FR. It is in various colors and various patterns. And it is good for upholstery because it has a lot of marking tail and also for curtains, for plates, for cushions, uh, whatever you like. It is washable and it is plain to as well. Mm -hmm. Okay, Ms. Robert uh, Thompson, anything else you'd like to say? No, thank you for the opportunity. I really love your products. They're, they're beautiful, they're soft. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, I see this happening. Okay, thank you very much for the explanation. It's been very interesting and I have learned a lot. <laughs>